69 pounds and the league leader in block shots. Claxton won the tip. And Claxton going right <laughs> to the rim. Look at it here. Claxton looked like he was trying to work a two-man game. No one picked him up. Get the Nets on the board. An early 2-0 lead here for Long Island. Xavier Munford, the floater. Winning ways, the Nets 8-3 in their last 11 games. Winning canes in all sorts of ways, like we were mentioning, Kevin. Starting to believe, perhaps, that a playoff appearance is within reach. Back-to-back, -back, of course, Nets. Jeremiah Martin, a nice job on that prior Long Island possession. Kind of faking out Kumaji and laying it in. And Zaire Smith on the other end for the Blue Coats. Shayok guarded by Martin. Martin, Long Island's top defensive stopper of the two meetings be uh, uh, against Delaware. And like you said, he'll draw the Mario Shayok assignment for sure here tonight. Claxton finds a cutting Martin. Jeremiah Martin, a couple of buckets at the rim. Good passing from Delaware. Smith inside. He's got an early four. How about the sidestep there on Devin Kennedy? Beautifully done there by Zaire Smith. Zaire Smith, last year's first round pick of the Sixers via Phoenix on a draft night trade. 16th overall. Devin Kennedy, mid range jumper. Seven games this season with Philadelphia. His last NBA action back on February 7th. It is an 11 8 Blue Coats lead, a little over three minutes in. And Munford along with Mario Shayok, two of the Delaware players that have feasted on Long Island so far this year. John and Musa answering for Long Island. Floor Delaware, five out of seven. Munford, mid-range jumper, he can't. As Kumaji takes a seat at that whistle, Dennis Clifford in the game. Another big guy who can protect the rim, but John and Musa going right through him. Martin. Working on Clifford, Jeremiah Martin has that deflected. Kasababu, the offensive rebound. Nicholas Claxton in the starting lineup. Jonathan ba uh, Kasababu coming off the bench. Mariel Shayok quickly back the other way. Jared Brownridge in for the first time for Delaware. Dishes out for Smith. Now he gets it back. Brownridge cans the three. Big three-point shooting games. Had a game last season where he scored 31 here at the Coliseum, made five of 11 threes in a Delaware win as Casababu inside, able to finish over Clifford. Jonathan Casababu, a couple of buckets since entering for Claxton. Shayok, mid-range jumper, rattles home and the scoring just won't stop here in this first quarter, Matt. Jared Brownridge, transition three is good. He's made his first two from downtown. Xavier Munford. <laughs> Zaire Smith, straightaway three won't go. Kennedy up ahead for C.J. Williams in transition. He can't finish, but Johnny on the spot to pick up his own rebound. And Williams found himself right there to pick up the rebound and put it back in. Julian Washburn going right to the rim and picks up a foul on Kasababu. Chance for a three-point play for Washburn. That game on the road at Capital City. You get a look here. Getting bumped by Kasababu. Now Jalen Hands has five. Hands, mid-range jumper is good. Great take on right at Kumaji putting on the brakes. Almost had his own rebound there, but Munford is up with it. Xavier Munford, mid-range jumper. On finds existence, hates the Cedos, but kind of forced into doing it if you're the Nets. Jared Brownridge for Bryson. Down to three to shoot. Michael Bryson, fall away jumper off glass. And Delaware forcing a turnover. It is Munford going right back to work. Bryson bounced it off his face. And Jalen hands up with the loose ball. Not often you see that. C.J. Williams a corner three. And clogging up the middle. Worked out well for the Nets. Mariel Shayok misses the three. Claxton has done a nice job on the defensive glass against Kumaji. And here he takes it coast to coast. Fading at the thought of Nicholas Claxton. What he can do so skilled along with Chris Kumaji himself. Three tries on that possession for Long Island. Couldn't get any of them to drop. Bryson, pull-up jumper in transition. Kumaji the follow. Kumaji pulls down the rebound off the miss from Hands. And still kind of limping up the floor as Shayok counted and won. Just a matter of time before Shayok gets going, working on C.J. Williams. C.J. Massenberg. 
He'll drive it. Massenburg, tough take blocked by Kumaji. This season in the G League 12, that's the number to beat. Averages four per game. Claxton. Can't to get to 10 here on the three-point play. Working on Dennis Clifford. This is seventh game on assignment. Shayok turning in the lane, gets it to drop. Extra pass, Julian Washburn will go to the rim by himself. Anderson driving on Clifford. There's Justin Anderson getting on the score sheet. Shayok, mid-range jumper, Mariel Shayok starting to heat up for the Bluecoats. Martin has to keep it across the front court and gives it up to Brownridge for an easy lay. Kennedy, the floater over Kumaji. A little over a foot in that matchup and still able to get it to go over Kumaji. Munford. Three-pointers at the other end. That is not sustainable. 23 in the first half for Munford. Egbunu, the offensive rebound. Zaire Smith on the pump fake, takes it inside. Not Big men in the lane by the Bluecoats. Shooting a white hot 55% from the field. Justin Anderson inside over Kumaji. Kennedy on the loose ball, finds Egbunu. Trying to power his way through Kumaji, can't do so. Egbunu again, this time he gets it to go. Stubborn inside, John Egbunu, he wasn't giving that ball up. Zaire Smith fouled by Kennedy, count it, and one. Yeah, Kennedy, good look at a three, rims out. Claxton on the offensive glass. Bryson for Clifford, back to Bryson, down to five. Bryson through the contact, able to finish. Just working on a kind of quiet triple-double, a four, five, and six in that first half, but you double all those, get him another bucket and a triple-double certainly in play as Devin Kennedy connects from downtown. Back on February 1st at Erie, 18 points, 20 rebounds, and 12 blocks in that game. Another steal, Jeremiah Martin ahead of the pack, a 7-0 run for Long Island to open up the third. That could block shots, but the numbers have really kind of gone off the charts since he's gotten... Claxton now working on Clifford. Nicholas Claxton to the right on assignment here with Long Island. Here will fire a three. Claxton can do it all. Second made three of the game for Claxton. He pulls down the rebound on the defensive end. He's going to take it himself. Bouncing for Kennedy who lays it in. To get a look at the potential of Nick Claxton and what he can bring to that Brooklyn team potentially in the near future. Musa inside off the turnover and Long Island's lead is nine. That pass from Kennedy in the presence of mind of John and Musa to catch it and go right up with it immediately. Mariel Shayok. First three point attempt of the game. Only four points on four field goal attempts in 20 minutes for Anderson. And only two of four. Shayok knocks down the straightaway three and Delaware back within four. Played two games in the NBA for the 76ers this year but did finally make his debut in early February. Jeremiah Martin up to eight points. Jared Brownridge up top for Munford. Three to shoot. Xavier Munford, splat. And it's a four point game, Kasababu. Has it knocked away by Highsmith. Haywood Highsmith ahead of the pack. C.J. Williams off for hands. Good look at a three. It's good. By Massenburg. Jalen Hands crossing over to the rim. Tough finish from Jalen Hands. Beautiful. Hands wants more. Instead kicks out. Claxton a corner triple. Mariel Shayok finds a cutting high Smith. Kick out. Zaire Smith. Off for Doral Moore. Finishes over Claxton. Women who inspired them most in their lives. We mentioned it earlier, going to be some happy grandmas and moms watching the game here tonight. Scored Delaware by 17 in the third, 37-20. And picking up where they left off to start the fourth, John Agbunu the bucket, Zaire Smith the answer for the Bluecoats. Delaware only shot at 30% in the third, 
Only six of 20 from the field for the Bluecoats in the period. Jalen hands inside again for Egbunu, and he's fouled by Moore. Count the bucket for John Egbunu. Mariel Shayok the reverse. Definitely have their work cut out for him here in the fourth quarter. Shayok misses, Adele the rebound. Jalen Hands turning on the Jets. Hands in transition, another nifty finish. It's a 12 point game, 101-89. CJ Williams inside. Great recognition there, CJ Massenberg to CJ Williams. The 11 Nets who have played at least 10 minutes in this game. Sean Fine because of the back to back and travel situation. And this would be the point of the game where you have to wonder about the fatigue for Long Island, especially with these starters in the ball game who all played quite a bit last night as well. Egbunu to the rim. After missing 13 games, that thunderous, ferocious inside presence. Been up to 36 points. Martin inside for Egbunu. Comes back to Jeremiah Martin. He'll go right at Clifford. Egbunu there to clean it up. Fewest in a game was five in a game against the Canton Charge. Goes back a couple days after Christmas. Musa, a deep three. And Long Island going back to that 2-3 zone. Brownridge able to knock it down from the corner. Musa blowing by Clifford. And a timeout taken by Delaware. Make your free throws. You'll win a lot of ball games, and Long Island has done that. Anderson throwing it down. He was asserting his will there and trying to do it again, going right at Kumaji. Claxton cleans it up. Maybe the home scorebook will get it done. Either way, it's going to be 32 points, an impressive 32 for Nicholas Claxton. If someone just parachuted in on this game and I asked you which team played last night and which team was fully rested, you would almost assuredly say that Long Island was rested and Delaware is on the back-to-back, -back, but alas, it is the Nets' last 15 games. And I wanted to ask Coach Fine if he thought that Martin was a calming presence, even though this is his first year as a professional. And Sean Fine was certainly in agreement. Under two to play, it is a 15-point lead. Zaire Smith, corner three. Lobs one up for Claxton inside. Able to stop the clock here in the arena and takes out of that you know, human error delay time from our clock operators here along the scorer's table. And Delaware just going to dribble things out here. An impressive win for Long Island. They make it nine wins in their last 12 games. The final score, 124 to 108.